Alright, welcome back to another video by Gamer J. Today we attack Golem. We're going to attempt this with Shermite Armor. Can you see the invisible me hanging above the summoning platform? Uh, we are going to use crystal bullets for our bullets. We're going to attempt to cheese the fight. You see we've spaced out some blocks around Golem's landing location to trap his movement. I didn't do specific measurements for this. I don't know if it's going to work correctly, but we're going to give it a shot right now. Uh, our buffs are going to be well fed from some cooked uh, bass. Uh, we're going to use shine potion mostly for video purposes, uh, regeneration potion, iron skin potion, swiftness potion, and then just because we have a couple thorns potion, and of course we'll have our standby campfire and heart lanterns. I did forget to bring power cells from my earlier clear of the temple, uh, but I managed to get two from the mobs when clearing the boss room uh, with a stroke of brilliant luck. So let's hope our luck continues and that we're able to just do this with our mostly with our Mega Shark and our Shroomite armor. Alright. Let's see if I can't figure out how to reset this guy. Uh, I don't think that's gonna be a problem for us. Left click didn't work. Right click worked. Alright, so far the cheese seems to be working ish. Something hit me. Nice shooting fireballs. So it looks like we're going to use some movement. Uh, Alright, we're getting hurt. <laughs> so even with cheese, it's, uh, it's not just a sit down and shoot shit. Uh, shoot stuff. Oops. <laughs> My editing skills will get better later. <laughs> I'm okay to use a potion here. Yeah, in the past we've used chlor chlorified bullets, or I've used chlorified bullets uh, for this. Um, figure that having them trapped um, be good. But wow, uh, those fists are a lot more furious. <laughs> um, second form. Uh, maybe I should have focused on getting rid of them before moving on, but yeah, it looks like we're doing alright so far, uh, even uh, in second form. Uh, we're not, uh, not getting destroyed here. Uh, you know, we don't have to worry about his jumps, I guess. Uh, I think that's the advantage of the cheese. Um, and uh, we use one health potion, and done. Um, we're going to try and go for another make at it. Um, let's see our bolt count uh, with our Shermite armor bonuses. Uh, we're still, we started at 999. We got plenty to go. Um, we only have one more cell, um, but we might as well give it a go. Uh, I'm not even going to worry about trying to uh, get those fists down. Uh, with the ease that we finish that off with. Uh, it's going to remember to move around. Uh, looks like my summons doesn't really do much for me in this fight, but that's alright. Uh, I'm sure that's because of the cheese factor mostly. And it's blocked off the same as uh, Golem is blocked off for me. I uh, did manage to get it in there. Um, while I was flying up, I had a little bit more space up there at the top. Uh, looks like it's still not enough for the golem to really come through. Oop. Laser face is shooting at me. Uh, let's see if I can buff up again or not. I hit my buff button, I have no idea if I rebuffed anything or not. <laughs> Um, I am just not looking that closely over there at that bar, but I know I hit the the B on my keyboard to get the bus going. 
Um, we're, we're, we're still in pretty good shape here. Um, I think we're about to hit and rage for the second phase or the third phase. Maybe the second phase is when he starts shooting at me from his eyes, right? So the final stage is coming up here. We're getting close on the body. Um, and I wonder if the crystal bolts are more effective because of uh, the blocks that we have in the way. I feel like the chlorophyte bullets would actually hit those blocks if they're being guided, whereas the chlorophyte might be splitting and still getting some damage in. I'm sorry, where the, where the, yeah, the crystals are, uh, are splitting. Um, I haven't used a single health potion yet, uh, so we're just using our regeneration potion, really, and uh, the heart lanterns and the fire is it. And there we go. So uh, we made easy, easy work out of out of going. I'm going to switch back to my chlorophyte here. Uh, I like seeing where I am. <laughs> uh, let's go ahead and open up and see what we got. Uh, it does look like we did get through a second set of buffs as we use both our thorn potions. Um, beetle husks, uh, you pretty much always get those. Um, possessed hatchet uh, melee. Uh, so uh, it's weak. Um, but it's it's kind of like a thrown weapon, very fast. Uh, it can be very useful, but I'm not going for a melee build. Uh, shiny stone uh, increases life gen when not moving. Um, greatly increases it. So I mean, I guess I could replace my uh, charm of myths, uh, which I should have had <laughs> equipped instead of my yo-yo bag, um, which provides uh, life regeneration and reduces cooldown of healing potions. I definitely should have had that on <laughs> for my healing potions. Uh, you know, fortunately. Uh, you know, uh, Golem is probably one of the easiest bosses in the game. Alright, let's get our second set here. Um, Staff of Earth summons a powerful boulder. Is that going to hurt me? No. Excellent. Uh, well, that's pretty neat. Uh, you know, more than one can be out at a time. And of course, another shiny stone. Um, I'm not super excited about any of that. Um, you know, uh, and I feel like we're not going to use it at all. Um, I will see if I'm going to farm out golem any more than that. Uh, you know, aside from just you know the sake of, of doing it. Um, you know, I feel like uh, there's there's a way. Well, let's let's go check it out. Oh, uh, let's switch over to our infinite bullets. And uh, let's head back home and see what we can build with these husks. Um, I feel like after beating Golem, I should be able to mine those those bricks, but no, that doesn't do it. It gives me beetle armor. Uh, so, uh, and I need Soul of Flight for the wings. Okay, so I need turtle armor to make needle armor. Um, 40 will do it. Uh, but it's, uh, you know, it's, it's melee tanking here. Um, I might build it just for the heck of it. I think it looks awesome. I might just want to have it around. Uh, but for now, we're just going to stick it into our... put it with our lore. I don't think we'll put it with our mats. We've got plenty of space there. All right, that's that's pretty much it. We're gonna organize it. Um, I've got to find out what the next pickaxe is that I can get, uh, and, uh, and we'll go from there. Uh, you know, the, the only two things that I have left to, to do, um, yeah, that I uh, that I want to get to before trying to do the final end game bits are get a sniper rifle from the dungeon and uh, a Duke Fisher on. And uh, you know, we'll, we'll redo our video on the truffle worm, uh, truffle worm farm. Uh, but you know, take a quick look at my inventory. Oh, my, one. <laughs> my other inventory for fishing. <laughs> and I've got uh, I've got 27 truffle worms uh, you know, all ready to go. So I've got more power cells to go fight coal more in case there is uh, you know, a drop that I need there. Like 
like a pickaxe. Um, I feel like I feel like I can like I should be able to mine those bricks after feeding him, and I just don't know uh, what I'm missing right now. So uh, yeah, it was uh, we we made it look easy, uh, hopefully because it just is easy, and, uh, and I'm not particularly overpowered in any way. And the big overpower that I have is the Unreal on Mega Shark. Uh, you know, you don't need it to be Unreal. Uh, I uh, I can get pretty much whatever modifier I want um, if I just uh, if I just do it over and over again. I've got plenty of funds. I didn't cheat the funds in any way, unless you count farming cheating. But my farming came from Mimic Farm, and uh, you know, we'll we'll show you how the Mimic Farms are created at some point if you want. You see my Tropical Worm Farm is right over here, and you can see these green areas uh, where my Chlorophyte Farms are. And uh, I definitely need to go mine those out um, so I can try out my summoning armor that I want um, to mess around with. Uh, I think that I'm still going to try and do this as a ranger gun um, playthrough, but uh, but I've never done summoners before, and I really like to uh, see. I have been to the dungeon a few times, um, and I've got plenty of ectoplasm, uh, so I should be able to make uh, that that armor without any difficulty. All right, guys, uh, thank you for watching. I am Gamer J, and I hope you have a wonderful day.